adventure hole. So we more or less just escape from this. Let's look at our new options. I think the well, string of the letter at the bottom of this is basically when it, a code. So the game basically saves every time you put your identity code into a lift. With the, all the stats and the information probably included in that. That's my guess at least, but uh, I don't really have a use for it. Uh, 5, 4 and G have been gone through. 3, 2, 1. No 3, no 2. No one. We get the sub levels. Sub level one. Okay. Ah, uh, this doesn't go anywhere. We need to reach the other elevator, I guess, or have a bomb here. Well, if you have to actually do it this way, we might as well go to the first floor. That seems like the best way to do things. Go further down. Yes. Okay, grey on grey backgrounds. Fucking majestic. Let's have a look. Enemy spawn spots. Two enemy spawn spots. A uh, hologram. Failed to repair it. Maybe we should ditch the holograms, friendly they are, terrible items. Go to the... Collect an embryo and go to the car park to finish the game. Well, uh, thanks. I don't want the inventory clutter, so I'm dropping these and not using them. What is a car part, though? I haven't exactly seen cars. Was it the place we started the game from? That was level 5. A lot of security systems here. Is this an actual enemy? I don't think it is. There's a projector that led to it. I think it's uh, there to scare the shit out of you.
to recharge my energy soon. That's why we probably should have uh, gone somewhere else and lived to that quick recharge. I do have the other recharge items though, so I'm not too worried about it. I definitely took damage, but I'm not sure what. Oh. Isn't this convenient? A lot of uh, security systems here. Another one. Uh, which reminds me we're going to recharge the gun. And shooting with it, with it for a while. Uh, I wish the gun would just basically drain the power from your equipment directly, that would be much more convenient. Another dead end here. Hopefully, it has something worthwhile. Six target. Seems like a much more straightforward level than the previous ones. It's a big maze to go through a lot of security systems, but there's nothing uh, all that complicated about it. And while we're here, I'm gonna test a grenade. What the fuck does a grenade do? Yeah, that's not a convenient thing. Also, did I use all my grenades or what? No, it just changed to a different item for no particular reason. Okay, it's a very short range thing. I don't see that being too effective in a fight unless there's some kind of super boss in the game. This is a tool, not a weapon. Need to permanently destroy lights. That's pretty much all the only thing I can think of. The inconvenient. No, it's another projector. Might be able to ignore these projectors entirely, but I don't know. They might also trigger an alarm, so I don't have to risk it. Some juice. I don't have that much juice left. Five ring pills. It's not exactly horrible, but uh, we had nine at one point, so. We're running out. Slowly but surely. It's not an elevator. We don't actually need to go in there. It probably might be better if we don't. There's something moving there. It 
quad two three. Yeah, I think we're just gonna use the block kick. That's so much faster. Five eight two three. Five eight three two. Five eight something. It's supposed to show the actual code for like five seconds. That's not five seconds. At least we get to charge up our energy. Minor damage to center torso. <coughs> right, the visor is absolutely worthless as far as putting the those things are concerned. The only possible use for the visor is if we have to go in the lab. Basically darkness. And it's a, a very real possibility. Because Robots can see in the darkness. Living creatures cannot. So if there's a lot of uh, monsters or guards in our area, they have at least a viable means of trying to evade them like that. Alright, I don't have time for this shit. Camera assaults are apparently very, very short range things. Five eight three two. Okay, you came inside. Taking damage from something. <sighs> I'm taking damage from something. Or at least hits from something which are about the damage part. No idea. This might be one of those things that we could have easily done is blow a hole that will come here, take the job, take the stuff, get the hell out. I guess I'll try to fly our juice and get the hell out of here. We're just drinking it down so quickly. 
won't last. So with any luck we should not really encounter any heavy resistance. Take that much damage this time either. There's an elevator here, I we might want to take it. Because we couldn't get to the first level in the elevator of the south east corner. So the northwest elevator is probably the only way to access it. I'm not sure if it's something we want to go, but it could be the another extra access we do need in the end anyway. I think these are just normal guards here. Seems like it's a large room, so it could be pretty bad. idea how useful this could in reality be. From the description they seem pieces of shit. This is a dead end. This is not a way to get to the elevator. It's a way to get a couple of items. A refill I'll take that, thank you very much. I'm beginning to think that a bomb might be a very very valuable thing. In this case, it was just security systems we needed to bypass, or rather could have bypassed by blowing up the wall. But later on it would be a lot of enemies. And that's something, damage is the biggest thing we can really easily deal with. Just not enough health kits. Pretty much electrical defenses, so they should be easy path to the southeastern elevator if you want to take it. I, I still want to at least check the other elevator and the level sub level 1. Why make it so hard to reach if it doesn't have something useful? So I'm either expecting a permanent use item like a uh, a gas mask or a medikit, or alternatively, it is a must reach place. So it uh, has another access upgrade for you. This would be a good time to go and get it if that's the case.
The benefit of taking the transparent reflective armor would have been that it would have actually been better than this against uh, ranged attacks, which is, seems to be most of the things you suffer from. At the same time, it would have been catastrophic if we had to go into... Well, the melee guys can easily block your path, there's not much you can do about it. Uh, unless you basically just go right through them, but then you risk getting uh, mauled pretty seriously. I don't know. I think this is a sort of a safe, mild bit for us. Maybe not the best possible option to take, but uh, not a catastrophic choice no matter what happens. It is. Probably there's an item here. Surely, no. Okay, there's a, also a dead end bath we can go to the south. There's a trigger you can jump over. Okay, well, I was definitely attacked, I'm still attacked, but apparently I don't see what. Okay, those are the holograms. Yeah, we're just getting injured and injured and injured. There's not much I can do. How long have we been there? situation. Hopefully this will end up being worth it. I'm not drinking anything anymore. I have to leave here instead of actually being inside the elevator. So. Just playing it safe. It, I don't think the next sliver is gonna end the game or anything, but uh, might as well play it, play it safe. I also like to leave it inside the elevator because the elevator is a safe place for us. So this was um, this was level two, and have we used the terminal? Starting keeping track of these because we're sort of going back and forth, and I have uh, no clear idea where we've been and where we've used them. I should have upgrade or access level 4 now. We're going to try to take a look at at least the uh, sub level 1. I'm not sure every level even has a terminal. I have no idea what the level of upgrade, access upgrades we need to take, but I'm assuming at this point that every level has a terminal. I feel that's a, that's a safer thing to assume than just assume that they for some reason don't have it. Wait, can I even get to the correct level? That's something we can test right now. I uh, more or less just need to look at the map there. Yep, you can get access to things. 
for what critical reason? Let's see. 